Leila lives in East Africa. She's just had a son, Adil. She feels there's something wrong with his eyes. He doesn't respond the same as her other children. Leila goes to a local child health clinic. They tell her it's nothing to worry about and give her antibiotics. But his eyes don't improve. If anything, they seem to be getting worse. She goes back again, two, three, four times more. But they tell her the same thing. She knows something is wrong, but no one can help her. Sadly, Leila's story isn't unique. In so many countries, children don't have access to eye care, leading to sight loss or blindness, which could have been prevented. Our project has started to change this, giving hope to children in over 100 countries worldwide. We have developed a model to include eye care into primary care, so that when a child goes to their local village health center, they can be seen by someone who knows how to check their eyes. In Tanzania, we train primary health workers in one region to screen, diagnose, and refer young children with potential eye problems using an innovative, low-cost new screening device. As a result, hundreds of thousands of young children are now receiving eye care. The results were so successful that the project was adopted by the government for the whole country. This is just the beginning. We anticipate that ministries of health in other countries will follow the example of Tanzania and will train their health workers to screen the eyes of all newborns and young children. Our aim is that every child in every country is screened so that millions of children with eye conditions can be found early and treated. Adil was one of the lucky ones. His mother kept trying, eventually reaching an eye clinic in the capital city. He was diagnosed with congenital cataracts and had urgent sight-saving surgery. From being blind, he will now be able to see. We want this to be the case for every child like Adil. How can you help? Find out more about our program and what we're achieving at childeyehealthproject.org.